how to connect Shopify to Payoneer. Full tutorial. Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'll be showing you how you can get started with connecting Shopify and Payoneer. So let's get into it. Now, these two platforms don't have an innate integration built in. There are some things you have to do, some prerequisites you have to meet to be able to actually connect both of these platforms together. Now, what are those prerequisites? Well, there are two basic ways to integrate them, and I'll show you guys both of these ways to integrate Shopify into Payoneer. But one thing to note is that if you have a personal Payoneer account, you can't directly connect that. So if you want to enable Payoneer checkout or just enable a payment acceptance system with Payoneer, then you need to make sure you have a business account, not a individual account. So let's get started. Now, what are these steps to follow when you're looking to connect Payoneer and Shopify? Because oftentimes when you open up Shopify and you're trying to connect Payoneer to Shopify, you go into settings and you try to find an app or you try to, you know, you go into the app store, you search for Payoneer, you can't find anything. And even if you go into the actual payment getaways, you're not going to find any payment getaway labeled as Payoneer. Well, how do you do it? Well, I'll show you guys exactly how. So to get started, just log on to your Shopify store. Once you are in your Shopify store, you're going to head on to settings on your bottom left. Once you've opened up your settings, you're going to click on payments on the left panel. And once you click on payments, if you click on choose a provider, the issue with that is that whenever you open up the choose a provider section and you search for Payoneer, it's not going to show any results. So what you're actually going to do is you're going to go back and you're going to click on add payment method and then you're going to click on search by provider. You can do pretty much the same thing when you click on choose a provider. And then on the top right, you have different payment methods. So it somehow, although it's pretty much the same thing, you're looking for a payment provider, it doesn't show you the option of Payoneer, which is actually available for Shopify. So you're going to click on add payment method and then click on search by provider. And then over here, you're just going to search for Payoneer and you're going to find this option over here, which is called Payoneer Checkout. Now, you need to have a business account and you need to actually create a payment checkout solution on Payoneer. So you're going to click on this and then click on it again. And I'll just uninstall it and then show you guys what it's going to look like. So you're going to go over here, go ahead and search for Payoneer over here. And click on Payoneer Checkout and then click on the Payoneer Checkout. Now over here you're just going to install this application and once the installation has been completed you actually want to activate it. So you're going to click on manage on the bottom right and if you are installing this for the first time ever then you're going to find the checkout option and then before the checkout option you're actually going to have your installation so you're going to click on install app over here. And once your installation is complete, you can go on ahead into your payments over here. And then you're going to click on manage. And now this will lead you to payoneer.com slash checkout. So Payoneer checkout enables you to globally accept payments on your store. And you can't use your pre-existing personal Payoneer account to accept, you know, payments. So you need to create an account on Payoneer checkout. So you're going to click on get started and you're going to enter your information and then just click on submit to be able to get started with building a Payoneer checkout on your Shopify store. Now, this is just one method to get started. There are some alternate ways that you can choose to get started. And what does that entail? Well, if you're looking to accept personal payments, there's a really long loophole that you can integrate. But if you already have a business account and you don't want to set up Payoneer Checkout, then it might be slightly simpler for you. So if you have a pre-existing Payoneer account, that is a business account. This is not a business account. This is a personal account. But if you want to take a look at a business account, so you're going to follow these steps. So you're going to go into your Payoneer account and then you're going to click on get paid on the left panel. Once you click on get paid, you're going to click on receiving accounts. And if you have a business account, you can select any one of your approved accounts. And once you do that, you're going to click on connecting to a marketplace. Now, this is a personal account, so I can't connect it to a marketplace, but you will see over here 
that you need to make sure that you know some of the basic prerequisites such as the name registration should be the same as the beneficiary name now you're going to have a direct option to connect to a marketplace if this is a actual business account so you can do it for any of your approved receiving accounts in your pioneer application so these are the two primary automated ways that you can connect pioneer to your shopify store However, some people might still wonder. I have a personal account and my store is not that big. I just want to accept payments into my Pioneer account. In that situation, although it is a tricky situation, I do have a little bit of a loophole for you guys. I wouldn't recommend this loophole to anyone, but if you really need to accept Pioneer payments and you have no other options, this is probably going to work for you. For that, you're going to go into settings and on Pioneer, the only thing you need to know about a receiving account or, you know, whenever you're sending money from Pioneer to Pioneer, you only need an email. So to be able to do that for your customers to send you money, all you need to do is provide them with your email. So what you're going to do is go into your Shopify store and then click on payments over here. Once you click on payments, you're going to scroll down and you're going to click on add manual payment method. Then you're going to click on create custom payment method and you're going to name it Pioneer. Then you're going to add account email and then you're going to type in your email XYZ, whatever it is at gmail.com. Then you're going to enter your payment instructions. So then you're going to add your payment instructions. Now, this is going to be displayed to customers after they place an order with this payment method. Now, you can include this directly in your additional details section. So I like to just put it over here and put it here in both of these sections. So what I like to do is add my instructions, which are going to be send your order total to this Pioneer account, create a screenshot and send to you know xyz email you know whatever confirmation email that you're using then it's going to be saying you will receive your payment confirmation within 24 hours so this is obviously going to be manual you're going to have to manually take a look at all of the people that have sent payments in and then you're going to have to manually match their screenshots to the payments and their order totals it's going to take time however if you have no other options this can be a simple way for you to accept payments globally especially if you're just a smaller business and you don't have a lot of international orders but you do have a couple and you're not sure how to take payments from international orders so this can be a simple and easy solution for that so i hope you guys found this video helpful if you did make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our youtube channel and if you have any questions or queries leave those in the comment box down below and i will catch you guys in the next video